From the Woodshed, a casual conversation with Chase Morrill and Ryan Eldridge from Kennebec Cabin Company, the team that inspired the hit show Main Cabin Masters. From the Woodshed is brought to you by Nelma. See the stamp, trust the quality. By Hero Media Arts, connecting small business with new customers. And by Hammond Lumber, your building project partner. Now, from the Woodshed Studios at KCC headquarters in Manchester, Maine, it's Chase and Ryan. From the Woodshed, I'm Chase Morrill. With me as always, Ryan Eldridge, Maggie Morrill. Hi, guys. Hi. We are here to talk about the end of the season. Back again. Feels like Groundhog Day. We are done with season two. It's been a great season and want to thank everybody for joining us. Thank you to all the fans for listening, all the questions. We want to thank our sponsors, Nelma.org, EasternWhitePine.org, SprucePineFur.org, HeroMediaArts.com, and Hammond Lumber Company, the official building material supplier of Kennebec Cabin Company. Episode 24. It's, yeah, it's, it's been kind a... kind of flew, flew by. It really did. I feel like we just started the, the podcast. Really, I don't. I feel like it's been like 10 years. You're going to miss yeah, us. As you, as you get older, like you have more stuff to base time on, so time goes by faster. But it's been, it's been a really fast season, too. Is you that a Cindy Lauper song? There was a lot that happened during season two. Yeah. Pandemic. Pandemic. Zoom. Zoom. We brought on some new segments. Yeah, new sponsors. New sponsors. Baxter Brewing Company, Duravent, Project Pointers. I liked it. Some of it I liked, but it was hard to get used to it for a while. Yeah, I think that, you know, the Zoom kind of shook it up. We had to do things a little bit out of order sometimes, but... I think we're going back to normal. Yeah. But what is normal? Dun, dun, what, dun. what is happening? We're getting deep. Yeah. We had some great guests. We had Tim Cotton. We had some awesome guests this year. Zach Fowler from Alone. Fle- that was oh, definitely Fletcher Fletcher's was so, favorite. Uh, so we had the guys, Chris from it, This Old House. Yes. Um, and Dan Patrick. Dan Pat. Yeah. Dan was on there. Um, Russ Lightgood from UMaine. Yeah, and Paul Paps with Dan Patrick. Yeah. We're still looking for a camp for you. They're going to come up sometime. I, I can see it. Perfect. I think we like, you know, we're going to take a break maybe. We're going to do some more. I like the live episode. Do you guys like the live one? That was fun. Sure. I want to do a live one with an audience someday, like Sports Center, or like College Dame Day. People will be outside with the signs. Like, <laughs> Maggie knows, has no idea what I'm talking about. We'll have a few hecklers. Eva will be out in the audience tackling us. You guys stink. <laughs> well, yeah, with the McMartins guys on. Yeah. Baxter yeah, yeah. Bruin. A lot. A lot. I, and what's, what amazes me is a lot of people still don't know about the podcast. So I've been talking to people at the woodshed and like asking me these questions like, go to the podcast because we talk about more in depth stuff. You know, we get to, you know, more rhyme and reason and a lot of facts. Yeah. And I half the stuff I didn't think people were actually going to like, and it amazes me when we go on to the when it goes live. People love all the information. Yeah, people definitely are hungry for especially more Maggie. Yeah, big fan. So, what are you going to season three? Will go on your resume next? That's pretty big. I mean, how many oh people God. in the world are season three executive producers of a podcast? <laughs> so annoying. I'm going to have to say not many. You know, <laughs> maybe a thousand. Yeah, it's quite a title. Add it, add it to your Kennebec Cabin Company application. Oh yeah, <laughs> looking for a job might give you a bump in a pay. So, who was your favorite guest? Can you pick one? Oh, I'm not gonna pick a favorite guest. They were all great. Good answer, Maggie. Yes. I can't remember past like two weeks ago, so I have no idea. My favorite new segment, I think, was Project Pointers. I think adding the videos in and people submitting the questions was a lot of fun. Actually, that's not true. I love talking to the camp owners after the fact. Yeah, a lot of good stuff. Yeah. It's just getting more and more fun. It's just like a kid, you can't pick your favorite, or I can't pick my favorite niece either. You know, it's like. Well, you're not supposed to tell them. It's all the same. We know. (laughs) You guys think someone's a favorite? Of course. No, not at all. That's right. It fluctuates. It fluctuates. He's my my nephew. (laughs) I love you guys. But yeah, we're getting pretty busy. You know, we're just getting into the summer, and we've got to take some time off to focus on the build, focus on the show. But we'll be back. A couple months? Month? We don't know. We don't so, know. Sooner than later, I bet. Yeah. We're getting some great guests for... Well, we're getting a... Nope. We will be back in July. I didn't read that far, did you? <laughs> nope. Damn it. We tried to go for September. but So we'll get, we'll get a couple months off, maybe. A month yeah. and a half. Time to kind of line up some new guests. Bring back some old guests. 
touch bases with some of these project pointers we've given out. That'll there. be fun. Like, yeah, <laughs> did you guys help me? Did you not help me? Make sure we're right on target. But we're not going anywhere. We'll no. be at the woodshed a lot. Um, a lot of events going on around here. We, we have music. You know, we talked about the Rock the Dock series last week. So, you know, we'll be here a lot. But it'd be nice just to have a couple Mondays off and revamp. Yeah, absolutely. We're still making episodes. We're still doing our thing. And the wrap, the, what are they called? Repack episodes will still be airing for a while. Yeah. Yeah, those go for like quite a while. Yeah. I guess Ashley's had her own episode. That came off good. Oh, good. Good. She good, didn't good. watch it, though. No. Yeah, so hopefully you're not getting sick of us out there, but if you are, oh well. <laughs> we'll be back if you are. Yeah, so if you have any suggestions, you know, going forward, like how you want to change the podcast, what we're doing right, what we've been doing wrong, you know, send that to podcast at maincabinmasters.com. So we're always looking to improve. You know, we're new at this. We don't necessarily know. There was no manual on how to do it. You know, like we don't know what we're doing. Thank God for Maggie and Jen to keep us in line. Absolutely. But yeah, we want feedback, criticism. All the your mother's favorite recipe, you know, you name it, we'll take it. Yeah. Maybe we'll, yeah, maybe it'll be a cooking podcast. Oh, we should do a cooking show. <laughs> what? <laughs> just kidding, well, just well, kidding. Rain just, it in. Just kidding. But we want to thank everybody for helping make this happen. You know, it's a whole team effort. Absolutely. We got quite the team now. Like it started out with just us and like, you know, we have podcast team. Of course we have the guys help us build, and we have the retail team, and then we have the woodshed team, like, we're building quite a big uh, community. It's, it's really wild. Yeah, and it's fun, and it's great to see it grow, so. It'll be nice to take some time off and really, you know, you keep doing it and doing it, you don't quite realize. So take some time off, reflect, and get ready for the future. Yep. And there'll be some teasers out there along the way, some videos to keep the interest going. We're putting Maggie to sleep. I know. She's, she's worked hard these past 24 episodes yeah. thank you maggie she thank deserves, you Jen. She deserves a break well, shout yeah. out to the guys out back and uh, andy andrea and brian and yeah did a great job everybody so yeah thank you guys thank you and thank you to our sponsors again nelma hero media arts hammond lumber company baxter brewing company duravent it's all products we believe in and they help make it happen see you in a month or two see you in a month or two from the woodshed we'll be talking to you in a month or two